Well, guys, the two million pan check from Mossad cleared, so it's time for me to start supporting the current thing. Obviously, I'm just taking the piss, and instead, I'm earmarking off the current thing, or should I say the old Bill, who got caught taking damn posters before then lying about the reasons why, and of course, getting called out for it online. How oh, fun! <laughs> Now, as you likely know, it all relates to the posters being put up everywhere for the people kidnapped by Hamas. This, as I've said before, should not even be a thing here, but thanks to politicians and mass immigration, it obviously is. Meaning this imported crap is front and centre, despite who kills who in the Middle East. Has absolutely sweet fuck all to do with us, understand? Then, of course, it's got to be said that everyone screaming they stand with Palestine or Israel is simply virtue signalling for foreign bullshit. Because unless they're ready to go over there and fight for them, they don't stand with jack shit and instead just want some likes on bloody Twitter. But virtue signalling toss pots aside, I have got to say I do agree with the old Bill taking down these propaganda pictures, which let's be honest, that's what they are. This is because it's got nothing to do with us like I said, and most importantly, the ostriches are not here, are they? So this literally helps no one. Your powers of observation continue to serve you well. No, they're apparently being held thousands of miles away by a group within Israel's own borders, so propaganda posters here are literally just that. Now, the fact that we do have propaganda posters being put up here about something 3,000 miles away does make me question who's funding it and, of course, why they're doing it. But I think that one there needs its own video, so instead we'll focus on the Met Police being caught pulling these things down, or should I say, their responses to being caught doing it. <laughs> Yeah, even though they are propaganda posters that shouldn't be there, I gotta say, it's not a good look for the old Bill to be pulling these down, and especially not after running damage control for foreign protesters screaming for jihad and shit last week. Not a great plan. I mean, it does look like the Met Police are running around taking down pro-Israeli stuff to stop the Muslim population shit in the bed and then causing mayhem. Obviously, the old Bill tried to say it wasn't that with a mealy math response that, I gotta be honest, just makes them look like a bunch of liars. I mean, in it they claim the posters had been put up on a pro-Palestine business just to cause tension, when obviously it's not the only video of the old Bill doing this we've got, because here we have more of them pulling them down. So yeah, I think it's almost beyond all doubt that the old Bill are running damage control for a group of foreign scumbags screaming about bullshit that, like I said, has got sweet fuck all to do with us. That's why, despite me agreeing that foreign propaganda should be taken down, the old Bill do need to be mugged off here, because their reasons for doing it are cowardly ones, the lily-livered fuck pigs. Shit, you could even call them the caliphate coppers at this point. <laughs> Anyway, for now, that's all I got for you on this shit show. So thanks for watching. As always, links are down below, and Rod Stewart's melted waxwork will take us to the outro. Pandemic. Pandemic. We're off!